Namaste, friends. It's me, Selfish Yogi. Look, I already know what you need. More election coverage. Yes. Welcome back to another episode of What the Fuck Did We Do? Again. I'm your host, Selfish Yogi, and thank you so much for coming. Oh, are you you're completely fed up with the politics of your own country? Oh, welcome to being a human fucking being. Look, not all of us can live in Scandinavian countries, all right? Because let's be honest, your life probably isn't going to change that much now that that Oompa Loompa is president again. Difficult times like these are the perfect opportunity to turn to the scriptures because the scriptures have stood the test of time. Wisdom is what we're after, not knowledge. Wisdom. This being a yoga channel, we turn to the yogic scriptures and perhaps the most important of them all, the Bhagavad Gita. Chapter 6, verse 5. Elevate yourself through the power of your mind and do not degrade yourself. For the mind can be the friend or the enemy of the self. It's all in the mind. So how is your state of mind? What are you paying attention to? See, we have a finite amount of energy and a finite amount of time. How do you want to spend it? See, we get caught in this us versus them mentality. We're being pitted against each other. The liberals and the conservatives, the men and the women, the gays and the straights, the whites and the blacks. It's time for us to come clean and take responsibility. It's not Trump. It's our fault. Trump is just a reflection of ourselves. And him winning is a reflection of where we are at. So take a good long look. Mmm. Yeah. Feels good, doesn't it? We did that. <laughs> Twice. The leaders of the free world. Kind of stopped saying that recently, haven't we? And listen. No hate for Trump. No hate on the Trumpers. He did nothing. He's just playing the game. Don't hate the player. Hate the game. And you know there's way too much hate going on. See, we don't have time for hate. We can't afford hate. It's time for us to come together. It's time for us to unify. It's time for us to transcend our political differences, our racial differences our spiritual differences. So today we are gonna come together, bring all aspects of our being into one, and that is yoga from the word yuj, translated as yoke, to make one. You are the gardener of your own mind. So what do you want to cultivate? Do you want your garden to be a place of insight, of inspiration, of equanimity? of peace, of bliss? Or do you want a desolate desert? A mind state filled with insecurity, with jealousy, with hatred, negativity. The choice is yours. And yours alone. So take the power. Be in charge of your own mental state. It's yours. So today we're going to take a stand for our own happiness. We are gonna practice to become our own best friends. 